hello everyone uh, this is uh, vaishnavi uh, talking from shankar medico academy i'm very sure you're all uh, familiar with the name and the academy shankar ias academy this uh, shankar medico academy is a uh, unit of shankar ias academy and we have recently started with this uh, venture of uh, teaching for the neat aspirants and uh, this year 2022 july 17th we had the uh, neat entrance examination uh, as we do the uh, extensive analysis of the upsc uh, preliminary question paper and then give the key for it similar attempts have been made to give the key for the uh, neat question paper also and uh, it has been published in the shankar medico academy's website today this particular uh, session what we are attempting is to present our uh, findings on how this neat questions are um, like uh, suiting from the tamil nadu's state board syllabus how they have been like covered extensively in the tamil nadu's state board uh, syllabus already the government has given some uh, details upon uh the reflection of the questions in the neat examination from the tamil nadu uh, government's uh, state board syllabus and here we are extending our analysis upon it and our team has uh, worked upon the four different sections physics chemistry botany and zoology uh, regarding the uh, reflection of the questions from our tamil nadu state syllabus so what i'll do here is i'll give you some presentation of the analysis what we have done it's only the numbers what i'm going to present to you right now the details of this presentation how much reflection has happened from each section of the uh, question paper will be given by our uh, faculty team in the tamil nadu state board syllabus padichittu neat exam ezhuda mudiyuma abdingra oru enna vandu ella tamil nadu oda ஸ்டூடெண்ட்ஸ்க்கு வந்து இருந்துகிட்டே இருக்கு மற்ற ஸ்டாண்டர்ட்ஸில் இருக்கிற மாதிரி நம்மளாலையும் பர்ஃபார்ம் பண்ண முடியுமா நீட்டுங்கிறத வந்து பன்னெண்டாவது கிளாஸ் முடிக்கும் பொழுதே என்னால் கிளியர் பண்ண முடியுமா இந்த மாதிரியான எண்ணங்கள் எல்லாம் ஏற்பட்டு ஏற்படுது ஸோ இதுக்கான ஒரு தெளிவான விளக்கு உரையாக தான் இந்த செஷனை நாங்கள் வந்து கண்டக்ட் பண்ணுறோம் இந்த வருஷத்தோட நீட்டு கொஷின் பேப்பரை அனலைஸ் பண்ணி அந்த இரநூறு கேள்விகளில் வந்து நூற்றி எழுபத்தி ஏழு கேள்விகள் வரைக்கும் நம்மளுடைய தமிழ்நாடு சிலபஸ்லேருந்து ரிஃப்ளெக்ட் ஆகிருக்கு அப்படிங்கிறத இந்த செஷன் வந்து உங்களுக்கு புரிய வைக்கும் அப்படின்னா நூற்றி எண்பது கேள்வியில் நூற்றி எழுபத்தி ஏழு கேள்வியும் என்னால் வந்து இதிலேருந்து எழுதிட முடியுமா அப்படின்னா அதனுடைய டீட்டெயில்ஸை வந்து நம்ம செக்ஷன் வைஸாக கொடுக்குறோம் அப்படி கொடுக்கும் பொழுது உங்களுக்கு வந்து செக்ஷன் ஏல எவ்வளோ கொஷின்ஸ் அட்டன் பண்ண முடியும் செக்ஷன் பியில் என்ன பண்ண முடியும் அப்படிங்கிறதையும் வந்து தெளிவாக நாங்கள் சொல்லியிருக்கோம் செக்ஷன் ஏலேருந்து ஹண்ட்ரட் அண்ட் டுவெண்ட்டி த்ரீ கொஷின்ஸ் அவுட் ஆஃப் ஒன் ஃபார்ட்டிங்கிறது வந்து உங்களால் பண்ண முடியும் செக்ஷன் பியில் எல்லா கேள்விகளையும் நம்மளுடைய தமிழ்நாடு ஸ்டேட் சிலபஸ்லேருந்தே அட்டன் பண்ண முடியும் அப்படிங்கிறது தான் இந்த செஷன் வந்து உங்களுக்கு எக்ஸ்பிளைன் பண்ண போகுது ஸோ செக்ஷன் ஏல நம்மளுக்கு பதினேழு கொஷின் வரலையே இது எப்படி நம்ம வந்து அட்ரஸ் பண்ணுறது கம்பல்சரியான கம்பல்சரியான செக்ஷன்லேருந்து நம்மளால் பண்ண முடியலையே அப்படின்னு நம்ம நினைக்கும்போது அதுலேயும் ஒரு ஆறு ஏழு கேள்விகள் வந்து கான்செப்ஷுவல் கிளாரிட்டி நம்ம புக்கு கொடுக்குது அதில் எக்ஸாம்பிள்ஸு இல்லைன்னா எக்ஸ்டெண்டடாக இருக்கக்கூடிய ஒரு சில விஷயங்கள் மட்டும்தான் இல்லைங்கிறது வந்து நம்மளுக்கு புரியுது ஸோ இந்த வீடியோ செஷன் மூலமாக நம்ம புரிஞ்சுக்க போகிறது என்னென்னா கண்டிப்பாக வந்து நம்மளுடைய ஸ்டேட் சிலபஸை வச்சு படித்து மட்டுமே நம்மளால் நீட் எக்ஸாமை ஒரு நல்ல ஸ்டாண்டர்டுக்கு அட்டன் பண்ண முடியும் அப்படிங்கிறத வந்து எக்ஸ்பிளைன் பண்ணுறதுக்கு தான் நாங்கள் வந்து அட்டம்ப்ட் பண்ணியிருக்கோம் இந்த செஷன்ஸை பார்த்துட்டு உங்களுக்கு ஏதாவது ஃபீட்பேக் இருந்ததுன்னா சங்கர் மெடிக்கோ அகாடமிக்கு நீங்கள் ஷேர் பண்ணலாம் திஸ் இஸ் அபவுட் தி நீட் கொஷின் பேப்பர் ஆஃப் ட்வெண்ட்டி As we all know, this year uh, we had the pattern of having 200 questions as a whole. and uh, the question paper was uh, divided as uh, section a and section b for physics chemistry botany and zoology section a had 35 questions and section b had 15 questions all the questions in section a was compulsory whereas in uh, the section b um, five questions uh, like we had a choice so there was a choice in the section b so therefore overall there was 20 questions which the uh, students can leave by choice so upon 180 what is the total score the students can get 
so this is the um, pattern for this year and now uh, we are going to reveal some uh, interesting facts about the um, questions which have reflected from Tamil Nadu's uh, state syllabus number one we would like to share with the data that out of the 200 questions we have had 177 questions which has come from Tamil Nadu state syllabus number two of this 177 questions we would like to present it in section A and section B so section A in put together of all the physics chemistry botany uh, zoology the total questions will be 140 out of which the reflections are 123 for us in section B we have total questions of 60 and we had reflections of 54 right so to go in bit detail about this representation in section A and B let me rewrite the numbers in section A how many questions were asked from physics chemistry botany and zoology which had a reflection from Tamil Nadu state syllabus we can say it is 33 31 28 and 31 so how many questions appeared from NCRT it is 2 4 7 and 4 so here you get this 123 as the total this is the numbers what we mentioned here as the total reflections and what was not present in the Tamil Nadu state syllabus book was 17 and I'm going to go into a bit detail about this point in a few minutes let me complete the section B also again in section B physics chemistry botany zoology how many questions were reflected from Tamil Nadu and how many questions exclusively only from NCRT we will give you some numbers physics chemistry botany and zoology so this makes a total of 54 questions here those students need not attend all the 54 questions or uh, 60 questions this is how the reflections bear and you can see that a minimal number of questions like six questions were coming exclusively from NCRT whereas majority of the questions could be attended from the Tamil Nadu state syllabus right so as of now if you rewrite whatever we have written here in the table we can mention that out of the total 140 questions which are there in section A 123 students could write based upon the Tamil Nadu's syllabus and the 40 questions which they have to appear from the section B all the 40 questions if they are thorough they will be able to write we are only saying if they are thorough they will be able to write because out of the 60 questions you can see 54 questions are having their reflections from the Tamil Nadu state syllabus so out of the 60 there is a choice of 20 so they can attempt the rest of the 40 so that is how the presentation has been given here right so I told you I am going to give you some more additional data on this uh, the 17 questions which we are saying in section A which has come from NCRT in this 17 questions we are going to have some questions which we can say there is a conceptual reflection out of the 17 questions we are going to say like around six questions they have the conceptual base in the Tamil Nadu state syllabus the meaning of this is the definition could be there the examples may not be there the examples might have been presented from NCRT or it could also be something like a question has four options two options the students will be knowing it and two options the students may not know it so these two options how did they know that examples have been given in the Tamil Nadu state syllabus book so by making some simple logical assumptions the student will still be able to do this kind of questions which we uh, call as the questions having the conceptual reflection say for example I have picked up the question number 83 which has come in uh, chemistry which we want to call only as conceptual reflection because not all the options in this question have the direct presentation in the Tamil Nadu state syllabus but we have this options 2 and 3 say for example we have the match list 1 with list 2 and you can see the drug class on the list 1 and uh, drug molecule on the list 2 
in our state syllabus book we have the examples for this morphine and submitted in in the tamil nadu's syllabus chemistry book so a student who can actually find out that analgesic as morphine say for example we are fixing with now two options in the answers so the answer should be between a and b i am a student from the tamil nadu state syllabus i have not heard about this seldin i have not heard about this salvar salvarsan but i know about this morphine and simetidin so now i have fixed one answer the moment i say that my antacid is simetidin the answer automatically becomes a i don't have to have the knowledge of the other two options which might come from the other book which is uh, the ncert book which we are quoting here so these kinds of conceptual reflections are going to add questions into the pool of what we already know so we can say that instead of this 17 questions we can only say that actually 11 questions have come exclusively from ncert so this is going to add to our numerator here right so you can say that out of the 140 questions for sure we can write 129 questions and in the section b all the 40 questions out of the 40 questions you will be able to attend so this kind of an analysis we would like to give now with the evidence in the presentation now, as i told you uh, we have seen the data and the statistics about the question pattern and the analysis and how our uh, state governments uh, uh, tamil nadu so state governments syllabus itself will be enabling the students to write this uh, competitive examination in a very good manner and get into the uh, medical uh, field so uh, we should be confidently studying about this examination uh, there need not be uh, much worries about whether we will be able to compete in such kind of an examination we are definitely on par with the quality and in the standard to compete with any kind of a um, uh, cbse syllabus or any kind of a background which are who are all coming from the other states so we wish to present this analysis through the uh, clear cut evidence of uh, uh, having the uh, faculties uh, with the tamil nadu syllabus book and they are going to tell you in each and every section uh in which volume in which unit number you are going to have the answers for this uh kindly follow the uh, session and then if you have uh, any feedback you can definitely write back to shankar medico academy thank you everyone